Hey, today I am going to uh, check on the apiary where our, I have our bees. And um, it's been a little bit, so uh, we usually try to check on them every two weeks. And I have my helper uh, down at the apiary uh, checking to see how things are going in the, uh, the beehives. Um, I can see here that um, they are actually going to change the, the boxes and make new frames. And here is what the frames look like. So we're preparing more frames um, to put in a couple of the boxes. So I'm going to go down there now and then and uh, see how things are going. It's um it's a little wet here today, so uh usually I mean it's the rainy season, but it usually doesn't rain until the afternoon. But I think there was a um uh just lots of rain in in the area for the last couple of days. So it's been a little wet and not as dry in the morning. Um Welcome back to my channel. I'm Natasha. I work to be self-sufficient, grow my own food, and live off the land. And I have an apiary on my farm that uh, I use to make honey. And uh, honey is one of those um, commodities that I consider the commodity because something that we can use all year round. And it, um, it's just a blessing to have, uh, better for your health. Uh, instead of sugar and um, watching the bees make it is just amazing so um, the apiary is far from my house which um, it needs to be but uh, it's in a little bit of a wooded area so that's where I'm going to now and um, again we're just going to check them and we're going to add more frames to the boxes um, here in Panama uh, it's November, so uh, it kind of starts that we're getting closer and closer to the um, summer season here, which is the best time to collect the honey. So I'm going to show you here where we're going to head down to. And my guys are, got the smoker out and... Uh, working to see what the bees have done, what they're doing, and how we can improve them with the frames. We have to clear oh, some of this land so we can get to this area. Um, so, and again, I got to be careful because it's, it's muddy and wet. I don't have my, my equipment on, my suit on, so I'm not going to get too close, but I just wanted to get an idea of um, how things are going. I have other videos on actually seeing the colmenas, the, uh, the beehives, as well as uh, watching us uh, get the honey. Um, that was last season. Uh, this is my second season um, producing honey. So, and uh, here we go. This area was uh, quite long, so I'm glad my guy cut it. But again, I'm not going to get too close here because I don't have my equipment on. So, but it. Uh... Hola, buenas. Como esta? Yeah? Okay. I never want to cut too much forested area, but um, we needed a little area within the forest that could get some sun. Uh, so this is where we put the 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 bee the beehives. And right now, uh, looks like we've got one, two, three. We're working on five. I think that's about as close as I'm going to get. 
So I see they're checking the third one. And again, they have, uh, I added four more boxes, three, four, or five. It's really important to uh, have the equipment uh, to do this project. Um, so I might go back up and get my equipment and come back down and get a little closer, but this gives you an idea of uh, what we do when we check the bees and check to see how the honey is producing. Uh, because this season, I really want to have um, a nice production of honey. Thanks for watching.